The Train to Christmas Town A Tale for Christmas by Richard Batchelor Today was the big day that Timmy was excited for. He was fully dressed and ready and ran across the floor to his parents who were ready too as he left towards the town. They all walked there together as the road followed right and down. They arrived at the train station they had their tickets in hand. They handed them to the controller and he told them where to stand. They moved over to the platform. Timmy looked on down the line. He could hear the sound of wheels on tracks as the train arrived on time. Timmy gasped at the sight of it. Eight carriages, red, white and green. It slowly came to a stop and let off a load of steam. The family got onto the train Timmy took the first seat on show. He knew which one he wanted. It was towards the front by a window. The train started to slowly move. The horn of the train filled the air. Timmy looked back down the tracks as they left the station back there. The train was now at full speed as it passed through the town wall. The train went through a tunnel. Now Timmy couldn't see at all. Timmy got very scared by the darkness. He held his mother's hand very tight. She pointed towards the front as the train moved out into the light. The train was now in the mountains. Light snow was falling from the sky. The tracks of the train began to rise and the train began to climb high. Timmy could hear the sound of bells. They were quiet but getting loud. Timmy looked as far as he could but all he could see was clouds. Then the clouds all disappeared. Timmy smiled as the train slowed down. It came to a stop as the bells played a song and they arrived at Christmas Town.